Today we're going to delve into the fascinating world of Martin Heidegger, a German philosopher who is considered one of the most important thinkers of the 20th century. Martin Heidegger was born on September 26, 1889, in the town of Meskisch, Germany. He grew up in a Catholic household and was originally planning to become a priest, but eventually changed his mind and decided to study philosophy instead. After completing his studies, Heidegger began teaching at the University of Freiburg in Germany. It was there that he developed his unique philosophical approach, which he called existential phenomenology. Heidegger's philosophy is notoriously difficult to summarize, but at its core is the idea that human beings are fundamentally thrown into the world and must confront the existential realities of mortality, anxiety, and meaninglessness. Heidegger believed that most of us try to avoid these fundamental questions by distracting ourselves with everyday concerns, but that true fulfillment can only be achieved by facing up to them directly. One of Heidegger's most famous works is his book titled Being and Time, which was published in 1927. In this book, Heidegger explores the nature of existence and what it means to be human. He argues that most of us go through life without truly understanding ourselves or our place in the world, and that we must engage in a process of self-discovery in order to live authentic lives. Heidegger's philosophy is also characterized by his use of language. He believed that words are not simply tools for communication, but are actually the primary means by which we understand the world around us. Heidegger was particularly interested in the German language, which he believed had a unique ability to express complex philosophical ideas. Heidegger's philosophy was not without controversy. However, in the 1930s, he briefly became involved with the Nazi party in Germany, which has led many to question his moral character. Heidegger later distanced himself from the Nazi party and claimed that his involvement was based on a misunderstanding of their true nature, but his association with them continues to be a subject of debate. Despite this controversy, Heidegger's philosophy continues to be widely studied and debated by philosophers around the world. His ideas have influenced numerous fields including existentialism, phenomenology, and hermeneutics. Heidegger's greatest achievements include not only his groundbreaking philosophical work, but also his influence on the field of education. He believed that education should be focused on cultivating a sense of individuality and authenticity in students, rather than simply transmitting knowledge. He also emphasized the importance of thinking critically and independently, rather than simply accepting what we are told. Heidegger died on May 26, 1976, in Freiburg, Germany. Despite the controversies surrounding his life, his contributions to philosophy and education continue to be studied today. In conclusion, Martin Heidegger was a complex and controversial figure, but his impact on philosophy and education cannot be denied. His unique approach to existential phenomenology, his emphasis on language and self-discovery, and his ideas about education continue to influence thinkers around the world. Whether you agree with his views or not, there's no denying that Martin Heidegger was one of the most important philosophers of the 20th century.